Rising close to the mayo roscommon border, the River Suck passes through Loch O'Flynn, a renowned trout fishing lake in North Roscommon. Well, Arnold, here we are on Loch O'Flynn, a couple of miles from Ballinlaw, a lovely lake. Could you tell us anything about the fishing on here? Uh, Bill, well this lake is about 300 acres in um, size, uh, it's a rich uh, limestone lake so with all the rich limestone lake it has good hatches of fly, um, it's an excellent trout fishery, there's wild trout uh, coming from the Clunecrin River here that spawn in the river just up from here which is the real source of the River Suck. Um, the lake itself then it's excellent for trout and it's also augmented by stocking from inland fisheries. We stock the lake just to boost the, the numbers of wild trout caught here. What sort of weights would you get on here now? Um, the average weight here would be about a pound and a half to two pound. Now there are fish three to four to five pound weight caught yeah, now yeah. and again, but generally around a pound to two pound weight yeah, would be the yeah. general. Apart from trout then, we also have uh, good stocks of pike here. Um, other fish include, um, there's all the species of coarse fish here, especially perch. Oh, yeah. And we have, uh, there's a good stock of eel here also as well. Yeah. I see there's a good few boats on the lake today, Arnold. There is, there's a good few boats here today, all right, Bill. Uh, generally what they do is they launch um, to the southern end of the lake. We have a slipway over yeah. there at the launch and they come out and they fish, generally fish the shallow areas here, all right. Would you have many competitions on here? Uh, regularly here on Sundays, especially now, there are usually boat competitions. There are a couple of clubs operating in the area and they have boat competitions here a lot of Sundays during the summertime, yeah, especially yeah. of the area. We're here on the shores of Lake O'Flynn. Ballinlock is part of the parish of Kiltulla and the parish built up around Kiltulla Hill on which was founded a church by St. Patrick en route to Crowpatrick. It is believed that he baptised the O'Flynn family who were the landed gentry in the area. The O'Flynn family are believed to have lived on the Cranoch here at Lake O'Flynn for a time until about the 1200s and from there they went on to build a castle at the avenue in Ballinlock. That castle was then destroyed in the 1600s and the stones from that were used to build the Church of Ireland here in the village of Ballinlock. The area is rich in heritage and um, history in that O'Sullivan Bear is believed to have walked through this area en route from Kinsale to Leitrim village. Another notable event in the history of Ballinlock was the burning of the RIC barracks in 1920, where three local volunteers, Glenn, Glavy and Kane, unfortunately lost their lives. These were recently commemorated as part of the 1916 commemorations, where their names were replaced on the streets here in the village of Ballinlock. We have a number of angling clubs in the area that also help to promote tourism and angling. It is visited by anglers as they head on to the west, the bigger lakes of the west, and often fish here and are very pleased with their catches, where significant catches have been reported recently. We're very lucky here in the village of Ballinlock to have such a spirit of volunteerism. We've many active groups who have done wonderful work in the area. A number of looped walks uh, that are part of the national trails has been developed. It also has a cycle route of 10 kilometres right around the lake. A local outdoor gym has also been developed in partnership with Roscommon County Council. So all of these amenities add to the attractiveness of the area. Mm -hmm. 